Welcome back. Uh, be sure to the tune in. By the way, we didn't hear from the Hardys on that bump. Yeah. 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 yeah, what happened? They were so. <laughs> they're so well behaved. I, I, uh, for a minute there, I was like, wait a minute. They're all like listening and paying yeah. attention. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but uh, I don't have to remind them, but I will you uh, to tune into Hallmark Channel this Saturday night for the season finale of When Calls the Heart at 8, 7 Central. So much in store. We're getting a sneak peek now from the stars of yeah. that fabulous show, <laughs> Daniel Lissing and Aaron Craig. Oh. All right. Yeah, hi. Yes. Thank home. you. Good to be home. It's good to have you here. Now, Jack and Elizabeth and the season finale spend most of their time in a coal mine looking mm -hmm. for Jack's dog. So, do you find, can you tell us if you find him? No? Um, no, we have to wait. Uh, do see. we want to give anything? Sure. Anything? Yeah. You know what? Yeah. Rip's going to be all right. Rip will oh, be Rip good. Will. Okay. But, in the meantime, I know that you guys had to work in a rather claustrophobic space like that. Have you in it real life? Cozy. Yeah. Did yeah. you have to? <laughs> did you draw from it from any experiences you might have had being claustrophobic somewhere? I've got a little story. I, I was um, <laughs> I was at my uh, a friend's birthday party and he lived on the eighth floor, and this is the only time I've ever felt claustrophobic. claustrophobic. Five mates got in the elevator and my cousin, Chris decided to try and race the elevator down the stairs, and lucky he did. We, we get in this thing and it gets stuck between the second and third floor. <laughs> and we were stuck in there for about 25 minutes with Chris, luckily, on the outside, trying to, trying trying to, to open, <laughs> open up and finally, with all these strength, he's like, Whoa! And we're like, yeah, it's doing good. <laughs> he did it all on his own, really? He did it all on his own, yeah. yeah. What was it like in there? Was it hot? Was it dark? Well, you know, it was with four other Mates, men, <laughs> Millie, men, men, right? You know, did anybody want to be like the Bruce Willis and pass through the thing at the top oh, and we crawl had a, up? We had a few suggestions, and then we had a, we had like a couple of guys that were a bit gung ho, and I was like, you know what? Let's. I'm more a little bit more sensible, so let's just, just hit the wait. call button. You know, they always have that little call. Chris button. is just on the other side yeah. of the door. We'll yeah. work it out. We'll work but it out. But those those 25 minutes were I didn't I didn't love it. Oh. Yeah, the, the claustrophobic <laughs> part of it is, I, I, I couldn't imagine what yeah. coal miners do when they I go. Know. That is right, and deep underground, ground. and especially back when our show was shot in 1910, where the safety regulations yeah, were, yeah. you know, almost what non-existent. Are, yeah. 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 What about you, Erin? Have you ever gotten stuck in anything? Or? I did, but it's kind of a horrible story. Like, Dan's is kind of fun. Mine is, I, I was in, like, third grade, and I went to a friend's house to go swimming. I went underwater, and they had a, a mattress-sized raft that someone threw into the pool, and they landed on top, and then I tried to come up for air, and there was suddenly something above me. And, oh, oh. What's funny? Yes. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> that is not funny. Well, you're here to tell the tale, you know? Yeah, that's we true. We can laugh about it now. We can laugh right. about it now. <laughs> well, you do. You laugh about, like, I, I will tell you, speaking about the lost dog, mm -hmm. uh, Fred, who a lot of people watch the show Fred. know I have Fat, Fat Freddy. Freddy. Mm. He's getting better. I'm taking care of him, okay? He's just now he's having, he's eating a jello diet. Okay. He only eats oh. things that Lego. looks like body parts. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, what? we lost him once. No, we didn't lose him. He just decided to go for a walk with another family. Mm. And mm. and they just walked away. And so friendly. But for my kids, it was so scary yeah. to have that. I don't, have you ever lost a pet? And Because now we look back at it and we kind of go, remember, whoosh, he was fine. And you kind of, but have you ever lost a dog or an animal at all? Well, I've, I've never actually lost one. I just know the pain of being away from them for a long time. Uh, like when I went off to college, it was sort of... I mean, it's very hard to be away from my family, but I grew up with four or five dogs all the time, and we we like to bring in Would shelter you live animals. In a kennel? Four or five dogs? <laughs> <laughs> look at that, look five at that picture. Give me that hey, one. Oh, is that, that you? Is that you? <laughs> That's me. With gr natural curly hair. Oh, yeah, girl. <laughs> um, yeah, and that girl. was our Borzoi. Oh, that is so oh, cute. Yeah. But you had. You mean you're not talking four or five dogs at once? You're yes, talking at once. At one time. I mean, not all the time, but growing up, we did have lots of dogs. My my family were big on um, rescuing animals, and um, oh. so so. Well, hopefully, you're going to rescue Rip. Hopefully. Rip, yeah. and uh, we're going we're gonna to have a uh, we're going to look at a clip right now because you guys have a lot of obstacles that you are still trying to work through. We're trying to work it out. Yeah, this, this finale. Um, make sure you tune in. This watch season finale. The season, season finale. Yeah. Make yeah. sure you tune in. Watch live, guys. It's a great, great one. Yeah. Really, I mean, there's so much happens in this episode. Yeah. Uh, and uh, we we kind of 
I don't want to give anything away, but a question will be asked at the end of this episode. Oh. Well, no, 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 no. Let's look. Let's see what this peek. is. Let's have, see if that question's in here. Okay. Let's look. Why did you say that I wasn't being honest about who I am? Elizabeth, I don't think this is where your heart is. Why would you say that? How long did it take you to come back here when your mother was sick? Jack, I couldn't just pick up and leave. She needed me. I understand that. And that's why you stayed. Not because of anything else. Are you talking about Charles? You and Charles have a lot in common. And I suppose you have a lot in common with that nurse. Faith, is it? Faith. Faith didn't try to change me into something that I'm not. In fact, the last thing she said to me before I came back was to remember who I am. Jack, when have I ever tried to change you? You wanted me to take the job your father offered me. No, I didn't. All right, I thought you should at least consider it and, and hear him out. There could actually be some advantages to working for him. And that's the problem right there. I don't see any problem at all except for the fact that you're not being very open-minded, and I don't understand why. Elizabeth. I gotta get back so to work. So do I. Wait. What? OK. okay. You let us on. Yeah. You're making us think that by this yeah. look at that, you guys aren't. That's two people this <laughs> way, not is. this way. I'm looking a lot. There's trouble in paradise. There okay. Is. This is too painful. <laughs> okay. You guys are so beautiful together. Come on. Yeah. This is hard. Yes. It is hard. Yeah. It's hard to watch the it's ups and the downs that. of this relationship, but it's I mean, I so good. Watch it. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I want to watch it. You've got to run back to that beach yeah. that you're talking about earlier. <laughs> so if it keeps going that way, I might yeah. have to. But Actually, you do share a love. It's a love for music, yeah. both of you in real life. We do. We really do. Where's it come from? Uh, well, you know, I, uh, I sort of grew up, um, certainly through my 20s, uh, taught myself how to play and sing and st played uh, in a couple of bands around Sydney. Wow. Yeah, you know. <laughs> and Aaron, do you have a background as well? In yeah, music? you know, we, we grew up singing around the house and um, my brother's really the talent musically, but I, I love doing plays and musicals and stuff in school and so... It's been a while, but we're happy to be singing together. Well, yeah. you're not. You're going to be singing also with a bandmate of yours. I'm going to let you do the introductions because he's a friend of yours. Yes, well, actually, one of my best friends in the whole world, my old housemate and the star of ABC Family's Chasing Life. Right, Richard Brancadasano. Yes. Hey, welcome. <laughs> what an introduction. Yes. <laughs> and uh, and welcome home to you too. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. So I, I called Rich and said, "Let's uh, let's jam," and he was what? like. Absolutely. And what are you going to perform? What are you going to sing? What are you going to jam? We're doing a song called Never Stop. It's by a band called Safety Suit. And we were first introduced to this song in a fan video. One of the Hardys made a, a video sort of honoring Jack and Elizabeth and their relationship. So this song is in dedication to all of you Hardys and all of you Hardys watching. We're so happy. All right. All right. Well, when, uh, you're, when you're ready. Get away. Yeah. Yep. Did I do that right? Boom. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Two, three. This is my love zone. Sleep each night, baby. I know I'm dreaming of you more. You're always hoping that we make it. You always want to keep my gaze. But you're the only one to see love. And that's the one thing that won't change. I won't ever stop trying. I won't ever stop watching as you leave. Stop holding your hand. I will never stop opening your door. I will never stop choosing you, babe. I will never get used to you. Still get my heart racing. You still get my heart racing. You still get my heart racing. You still get my heart racing. I will never stop trying. I will never stop watching as you leave. I will never stop losing my breath every time I see you looking back at me. And I will never stop holding your hand. I will never stop opening your door. I will never stop choosing you, babe. I will never get used to you. Still get my heart racing. You still get my heart racing. You still.
Ha, ha, ha.